afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Uh, as you guys can see here, this is a new water tank. This is the new one I ordered for the replacement of this old one here. And it took uh, about three days, four days, four working days. Uh, they gave me a call. I called them last week. Uh, Tuesday, Friday afternoon, they called me. It'll be available anytime Monday. So that's today. I went and picked it up as we got. So this old one here uh, has a leak in the seam right in here, but on the bottom side. So those are extremely hard to fix. Um, I'll probably have this tank available to sell, but uh, I'll let them know that there is a leak. Um, so this one here was purchased uh, and I just made sure that all the spigots, all the hole openings, everything is the same. And that's what I did. So I'm going to show you here in just a little bit where it's going to go. Okay, this is where the uh, tank's going to go. And I've removed the framing for the seat. It's underneath the uh, street side seat for the uh, dinette. So it's on that side. So over here, you'll see the little tubes coming out right there. That is a drain tube to drain any excess water or empty your tank. You don't want to keep water in there more than 30 days, two weeks. Yeah, you do. It starts getting old, mildewy, and smelly, and you don't want to do that. That's your fill tube. It's obvious, the biggest one. Fill tube, and it's gravity fed. That over here, this tube over there in the corner is the overflow, also a breather tube. It allows air in and out of the tank, but if it overflows, it'll flow through that tube and out. And then this one down here, right there, that is the one going to the pump. And it's a hand pump, as you can see here, hand pump, and it'll pump it right out, and that's what, they, that's what we're going to use. All right, I'll show you guys as we get them in. Okay, moment of truth, it's in, installed. All the tubes are in, connected, tightened. The fill tube, so we're gonna go out and pull the hose and get it in here. Okay, so we're filling the tank. Let me show you here. There's the water going in and there's the water has come out yet. I haven't got to that point. Nope. Still connected. Go inside. Okay, we're inside. It's filling. There's no water anywhere. No water anywhere. Not coming out of here. And not dripping out of here. Nothing here. And nothing there. So as soon as it fills up, we'll be doing some testing. But I wanted to check the emptying valve when it should be coming out real quick here in just a little bit we'll go outside and check okay so you see here that the uh, emptying valve is working tank has water in it so what I'm gonna do is close it so I can fill it there you go and uh, we'll wait till the tank fills and then we'll test the pump. All right, we'll try out the sink. There's the sink pumping away here, and it's going down, no problems. I have the uh, drain set up outside, just running out onto the right concrete driveway, but it is working. So we're getting water from down there which is it's sucking it from right there that corner and I checked it already check it again no water we're still filling we're not quite full yet so 
it's going along, moving along. The only thing I want to try, well, I don't really need to, is the overflow. But it's sucking air, which is what we needed to do, is bring in air. So we're good. We are good. This has been tested. I feel good about it, confident. Now I just got to get the uh, that piece right there back here and put the seat back together. All right. And that's how you reinstall a tank. No big deal. It's pretty easy. And, uh, yeah. Now, again, this is a little over uh, 10 gallons. Actually, it's about 12 and a half, almost 13. So if you figure 8 pounds per gallon of water, and this is going to be just a little over 100 pounds if you carry it full. I am going to leave about half a tank in there. I don't never really like to run dry because you never know if you stop and you need water, you have it. Uh, if you're always running dry and you're depending on going to a campground and you, uh, you know, fill up at the campground, that's great. But again, if you stop at a rest stop, you need water to wash your hands or whatever it may be. Um, you have it. That's the main thing, having it. All right. So talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.